Today, we are checking out the 2.9 Boosted, otherwise known as the 2021 9.11 Turbo S Inside a Drive World. So yeah, let's move on to the upgrades. For the engine, I recommend you get an i6 along with all the race upgrades. For the suspension tune, I recommend you pause the video, but here are some screenshots. For the gearbox, I recommend you get a 6 speed, but yeah, let's move on to the first race, which is Hurricane. Alright guys, we're here at Hurricane, so like I said, and yeah, we'll see you guys in a second with the results. Alright guys, looks like you can get a doable 1 minute 1.6 on Hurricane. But yeah, let's move on to the next race, which is Speed Avenue. Alright guys, we're here at Speed Avenue, just like I said, and yeah, we'll see you guys in a second with the results. Alright guys, looks like you can get a doable 55.8 on Speed Avenue, but yeah, let's move on to the final race, which is drag. Alright guys, we're here at drag, just like I said, and yeah, we'll see you guys in a second with the results. Alright guys, looks like you can get a doable 11.5 on drag. Alright guys, so if I was you, this car's decent. The top speed is decent, the acceleration is pretty decent, the handling's decent, and the brakes are decent but a bit long. Overall, this is a pretty decent starter car worth buying if you're relatively new to the game and you are looking for a car to go racing with, but there are better options for less cash like the Falcon for racing, which makes this car more of a collection car. So yeah, you guys let me know down in the comments what you guys think but other than that huge shout out to cloud and for all helping today's video don't forget to like and subscribe and we'll see you in the next one peace